Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com, new Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 19013 for Windows insiders on the fast ring. This is a 20H1 build and uh, definitely getting to the end of 20H1 now, and, but there are still a couple of changes coming through. Uh, the first one Microsoft call out is the Kimojis, yeah, Kimojis, that's the thing. And that's these uh, symbols here, so you've got the things like the shoulder shrug and all those as you can see them on here so Microsoft have updated those and they mentioned in the blog post and there you go so uh, that was using the uh, Kimoji input panel uh, Windows period key and that brings that up that's the emoji panel as well okay so that's the important stuff out of the way what else is new in this build not a huge amount of changes um, if you're using the Windows subsystem for system for Linux uh, version 2 the good news is that, that now unused memory goes back to Windows so um, memory used by the Linux subsystem will now return back to Windows when it's not needed in there which is good to see the rest of the changes are, uh, are all fairly minor there's quite a lot of fixes in this build in the blog post they do mention that uh, about your phone you don't need uh, dependency on Bluetooth for the screen mirroring but that still is dependent on the device so only a few Samsung phones that currently get that so I can't actually show you on that but I have got a separate video showing you how you can do your phone calling where you can actually call from your PC using your phone or receive calls on your PC using your phone so what are the rest of the changes in this build well they've fixed the issues with um, games running in full screen um, so when you were running games in full screen in the previous build um, it you would have a lot of performance issues and they fixed that they fixed issues with reset from PC and the cloud wasn't working I've got a video showing you how to do PC reset from a cloud actually um, they fixed some issues with calculator uh, sync engines Wi-Fi disconnecting uh, file explorer issues in fact I can uh, show you these where these issues are so here you can see the list of issues that have been fixed and the, there's quite a lot of them. That full game full screen was a big issue uh, that a lot of people had but these are the rest of the issues uh, including the surface uh, dial not scrolling properly. Uh, see you've got some narrator issues. There's only the three known issues on there. Battle Eye uh, which is like an anti-cheat software so that, that's an issue. Uh, settings isn't available outside the launch via um, the URIs so it's when you click a link somewhere else to take you to settings um, maybe like this um, that's working on there so but not all of these are working um, and uh, if you're using remote desktop and uh, you'll see an issue with the DWM start crashing and you'll get a black screen so if you're using a remote desktop to get onto a machine with running these Windows Insider builds you could have an issue with that so that's the rest of the, so that's all the changes and known issues uh, you can see more on our uh, blog on the digitallifestyle.com you can follow me on Twitter at isdixon I like documenting these build videos and hopefully we'll get some new features and we might get the next year's 20H2 build super soon but thanks for watching this video